Switching gears tonight, a veteran in the healthcare industry highlighting a number of projects in the pipeline that will help to ensure the development of healthcare in the country. Fern Carey tells us more. Continue to upgrade the country's public health sector, a veteran in the industry, Herbert Brown, says there are a number of projects that he would like to see completed at the Princess Margaret Hospital. Mr. Brown's comments come on the heels of his retirement from the Public Hospital Authority last evening, where he served for 15 years as managing director. He also served in public health for 47 years. Mr. Brown said he would like to see the maternity ward and accident and emergency at the Princess Margaret Hospital completed. As accident and emergency is the window, or some might say the doorway, to the Princess Margaret Hospital. Uh, and obviously, um, we want to ensure at the end of the day that when people go to our accident and emergency department, they feel the difference, not just seeing it, but actually feeling the difference. And so I would want to know that even though I'm not there, I'm confident um, with the commitment of the minister that you will see the further expansion and the upgrade of the accident and emergency. Reflecting on his 47-year tenure in public health, Mr. Brown said he worked with a dedicated group of men and women who helped to ensure the further development and expansion of the health care system in the country. It's because of them that we were successful in, in achieving many, many things within the Public Hospitals Authority, including major expansion to the Princess Margaret Hospital with the critical care block, major expansion to the Sunderland Rehabilitation Center, and of course, the Grand Bahama Health Services. There, we, we, we made significant investment in training, and we've also made significant investment in improving overall the quality of care we provide to the Bahamian people. And Here's how Mr. Brown responded when asked what his plans are for the future. I'm now going to take some time to spend with my family, particularly with my son, uh, and then I will move on from there. Fern Carey, Zedanas Network News.